Hey everyone, welcome back. Ready to dive deep. Let's do it. I'm always up for a deep dive, especially when it comes to sports. Me too, and this time we're going international. Mm -hmm. We're talking German table tennis. Oh cool, table tennis in Germany. You don't hear about that every day. What's the story? Well, we found this really interesting club online, DJK Kefferdel Vogelstang. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you, their story is full of surprises. Okay, you've piqued my interest. Lay it on me. So they've been around for ages, like over a century, founded back in 1921. But get this, just a few years ago, in 2019, they merged with another club, DJK Vogelstang. Hmm. Mergers are always interesting. In the world of sports clubs, they often point to bigger trends, wouldn't you say? Like, is it about resources or maybe even the popularity of the sport itself? Right. It makes you wonder, what does this merger tell us about table tennis in Mannheim, Germany, where this club is located? Yeah, could be a sign of things to come for smaller clubs, not just in Germany, but maybe even here. It's exactly. It's a whole ecosystem we're looking at. But back to DJK Keverdahl Vogelsang. They're definitely active. They're competing in the 2024-25 season and not just messing around either. They're in the Verbandsliga. Verbandsliga, that sounds serious. Oh, it is. That puts them at a pretty competitive regional level in the German league system. So we're not talking about a casual after work kind of club. These guys mean business. Totally. And you know what else struck me as interesting? How they describe the benefits of table tennis. Of course, they mentioned health and coordination, the usual suspects. But they also emphasize creativity. Creativity. That's not usually the first thing that comes to mind with table tennis, but I can see it. The strategy involved, the split-second decisions. Exactly. They're thinking ahead, anticipating their opponent's moves, outmaneuvering them. That takes some serious creativity. Absolutely. It's like a mental chess match played at lightning speed. Right. So next time someone says table tennis is just ping pong, you tell them it's a sport for creative minds. I'm adding that to my list of fun facts. So what else did you find out about this club? Are they still recruiting new creative minds? Well, they do have a pretty comprehensive training schedule, two locations even, with different programs for youth and adults. Seems pretty standard, right? Mm. But here's where it gets kind of curious on Wednesdays for the youth training. They have a note saying to check the schedule for updates. Hmm. Now that is interesting. Why single out Wednesdays? What could be so special about Wednesday youth training? I know, right? It's like a little mystery. My guess is they've got a more complex youth program than they're letting on at first glance. Maybe different skill levels, guest coaches, who knows? You'd really need to be in the loop to navigate those Wednesdays. It speaks volumes about their commitment to developing young talent, though. Not just anyone can play on Wednesdays, it seems. Exactly. And they're not just focused on training champions either. They're big on community engagement, especially when it comes to getting kids excited about table tennis. Yeah, they highlight this Spielmed program, which I'm guessing means play along or something like that. You got it. It's a nationwide initiative by the German Table Tennis Federation to encourage student involvement. And DJK Keffertal Vogelstang is all in, partnering with local schools like Vogelsang and Franklin. So they're really weaving themselves into the fabric of the community. This is more than just a club. It's a community hub. Totally. And you know what else? They even have a whole roster of sponsors, everyone from sporting goods stores to, get this, a solar panel company. Wow. Talk about covering all the bases. It seems like they've got a little something for everyone. Right. So there you have it. We've gone from zero to table tennis experts in just a few minutes, all thanks to DJK Kiffertal Vogelstein. I feel like I've learned more than just table tennis today. We've uncovered trends in sports club management, youth development, community engagement. This club is like a microcosm of broader societal trends. It really is. And speaking of broader trends, remember how the club highlighted the mental benefits of table tennis, that whole creativity aspect? Yeah. Makes you wonder, how can those benefits be applied off the court in everyday life? Now that's something to ponder. And on that note, We'll leave you to your thoughts. Until next time.